This HP Omen 15 might look fine, but check this out. Weird lines, crazy colors, most people think the screen is broken, but nope, that's the graphics card slowly dying. Today I'll show you how to spot the difference between a bad screen and a bad GPU. And then we'll tear this laptop apart to see what's going on inside. Let's get started. So this HP Omen 15 EK with a 10th generation Core i7 is showing a classic GPU. GPU failure symptoms. It still boots up fine, but it's only a matter of time before it's completely dies. Let me show you how to confirm the issue. See those lines and discolorations? A lot of people mistake those for a bad LCD, but here's the trick. Just connect it to external monitor. If the problem shows up there too, it's not the screen, it's a GPU. And this one is a definitely on its way out. All right, time to open it up. Step one one, flip it over and remove A screws. Important tip, the four screws by the hinges are longer than four up front. Mix them up and you risk damaging the palm rest. With the bottom case off, we can see the whole layout. First thing, disconnect and remove the battery. One catch, one of the mounts is hiding under the SSD, so you'll need to pull the SSD before the battery comes out, otherwise you could damage it. This model has two SSD slots for an upgrade two removable RAM slots and Wi-Fi card is soldered directly to the motherboard so no swapping that. Next let's take out the massive cooling system and this is a super important. Overheating kills GPU and the CPUs faster than anything. Always keep your fans and heatsink clean and if you remove the cooling system don't forget to apply fresh thermal paste before putting it back. With the cooling system out, I'll disconnect the ribbon cables, pull the motherboard and finally remove the hinge screws to separate the palm rest from the display. And that's it in the teardown complete. Love and peace to everybody.